A fighter jet engine is one of the most complex machines ever created. A true engineering marvel. Only a few countries like the USA, France, the UK, and Russia have mastered this technology. A jet engine has five main parts, air intake, compressor, combustion chamber, turbine, and exhaust nozzle. It works on Newton's third law of motion. For every action, there is an equal and opposite reaction. Simply put, when hot exhaust gases blast out of the engine at high speed, they create a powerful push that propels the fighter jet forward. But how does each part of this machine actually work? Let's break it down. It starts with the air intake, the fighter jet's first point of contact with the atmosphere. It acts like a smart funnel, capturing high-speed air and slowing it down, especially critical at supersonic speeds, so that it flows smoothly into the engine. This controlled airflow is essential for stable and efficient engine performance. Next up is the compressor. Here, the slowed air is squeezed tightly, dramatically increasing its pressure and temperature. The result? A dense, superheated stream of air, perfect for combustion. Now we enter the heart of the engine, the combustion chamber. This is where fuel is injected and ignited. The compressed air mixes with the fuel, and the mixture burns continuously, producing extremely hot, rapidly expanding gases. These gases rush into the turbine, spinning its blades at incredibly high speeds. That spinning power isn't wasted. It's used to drive the compressor up front, creating a beautifully efficient energy loop. Finally, the gases exit through the exhaust nozzle, accelerating out of the back of the engine at blistering speeds. And thanks to Newton's third law, that explosive exit creates the forward thrust that launches a fighter jet through the sky. And if this video gave you a new perspective, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe.